Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Candy Nails and I am back with another nail art tutorial video. So let's go ahead and hop right into this video. I already have my press on nail tips selected to the size of my fingers. I have buffed them and placed them on my nail stands. So I'm gonna go ahead and hop right in with my one of my favorite products by Young Nails, which is the Young Nails Protein Bond. Like I always say, this just helps with the adhesion of the polish to help your polish stay so that it doesn't chip or fade away. So I'm gonna go ahead and put that on all 10 nails. Now I'm gonna go ahead and polish all 10 nails. I'm gonna go in with a, a white polish by the company Model Ones in the color A030, just a basic white color. I'm gonna go ahead and apply two coats, curing in between each coat. So now that I am done with the white base on all 10 nails, I'm gonna go ahead and create my French tips. The first color I'm going to use is by Model Ones in the color A016. I'm gonna go ahead and create my French tip small line, clean up anything necessary with my isopropyl alcohol, and then cure that, and then I will do a second coat as well. I'm gonna be using the different colors for the M&Ms for each French tip.
Now I'm just dipping a nail art brush in a little bit of alcohol and I am just cleaning up my smile lines just to make them very sleek, pretty, and clean. So for the pointer finger, I'm going to do the yellow m and I'm going to use my Young Nails Manicure Yellow Neon in the 101 Gloss Color for my yellow French tip. I'm going to do the same thing as the red.
For my blue nail, I'm going to use Model 1's A033. It's a very pretty royal blue. And for my pinky, I'm going in with a color by You Cheer in the color number 14, a very, very pretty lime green for that green M&M. So now that I have all of the colors on my nails, I'm just going to go back in with each color and do a second coat just to make sure that everything is opaque. So now that those are done, they look gorgeous by themselves, but I'm going to go ahead and take it a little bit step further because this is candy nails. So I found these cute little M&M nail stickers on Etsy. You basically just peel and stick straight onto the nails. So I'm going to go ahead and place those onto the nails now. Now, as a disclaimer, everything that could go wrong for filming for me this day went wrong. 
So I did lose some of the footage of me placing my stickers on the middle nail, um, but I was able to record me placing the M&M stickers on the other nails. So I'll go ahead and show you that right now. I basically just select the sticker according to the color and I kind of just place them randomly until I was satisfied. So just as simple as that, just select all of your stickers according to the color or whatever your heart desires and you place them straight onto the nail. So after that, I'm going to go ahead and just top coat each nail just to seal in the stickers so that they don't lift or raise while I'm washing my hands. So of course, I have my favorite top coat, my Young Nail Stain Resistant Gel Top Coat. Just going to go ahead and apply that to each nail tip and cure in between. Right now I'm just wiping down the nails really quick with some isopropyl alcohol in a wipe. Um, sometimes you'll find when you are using your fingers to apply the stickers, things of that sort, there's a sticky layer that comes with each coating of polish that you do. So sometimes lint, dirt, debris, things like that can get stuck to the nail. And I definitely didn't want to top coat in any dirt, debris, or lint. So I went ahead and removed that before I applied my top coat. So here is the finished set. I had so much fun making these. They came out super cute. When I wore them and put them on from adults all the way down to children, just fell in love with my nails. So these were super fun, super cute, super easy. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And also hit the notification bell so that you can be notified for my next video. Until then, see you next time.